to pre-open this sucker because it's big. Okay, so we're back to traveling bags, right? And with this one, I said I'm gonna do something new. I have never, and I'm gonna use never, never been a person for a drawstring handbag or a backpack. Just didn't get it. Now, the reason why I say never is because way back when, in the early, early 90s, when we were revisiting, in my opinion, the backpack the first time, for me, I had so many. I had a silver one, I had black, I just, it was, it was all over, right? I mean, it was just, so I outgrew the idea of having a backpack, I was, I was over it, but I'm traveling and I'm carrying my cameras and my back is saying, sis, you need a backpack. So, what's in the box? This is from I Love Dooney and it is, it's a pebble leather Ronnie backpack. Pebble leather. I, you know, I haven't done a pebble leather bag in a while. I do them from time to time depending on what I'm looking for, but this backpack was the biggest one they had and it only came in pebble leather. I would have preferred like a Florentine or an Alto, but this is what I got. This is what they had. And this sucker, I was like, oh, okay. This is, this is, this is big. This is big. So there's a lot of packaging here, a lot of packaging here. But I am loving the size because I am seeing film, I am seeing the camera, cameras. And I'm also seeing a water bottle and probably sunscreen. This is going to be a good bag. Right, let's get into it because we have taken out all of the stuffing and there's a lot of stuffing in there. Um, there of course is a dust bag, so that's good. But here's what I'm liking. I'm liking this back zipper pouch, right? Cause I guess it's called a pocket, but perfect place for like your passport and stuff, your wallet. Anything you don't want anyone to have access to because it's right against your back. Very, very smart. On the front, there is another zippered pocket, which is really deep. Supposedly I could put my phone there if I wanted to. That's really deep. And I'm also thinking hand sanitizer, Kleenex, whatever I need quick access to. Tickets, that could be it. And then on the inside, on the inside, there are on the front here, two pockets, right? Two pockets there. And then on this back wall, there is another zippered pocket and another slip pocket here. So I got plenty of space. So let me tell you what we're thinking, because again, I'm carrying my camera. I should say cameras. But we are taking the roller cord, right? So that fits perfectly in there. I have my film. Because <laughs> I gotta put that in there so that I can go on the front. Oh, that's perfect. That's perfect. I do have my second camera because although I love film, you only get so many uh, images per roll, so I gotta have that. There is still room to do one or two things. Now, I can either take the zip wristlet, which I talked about in another video, I could put that in there. That's nice because that could be my wallet. Or if I'm not carrying that one, I could put in my other little pochette, I could put that in there. Whoa, man, that's um, that's nice. I'm really digging all that's in there. And if I wanted to, there actually is a room for a water bottle in here too. Like there's there's room in there. But I, I think I'm gonna be happy on my trip because my whole concern was I just wanted to have what I needed in a larger bag that wasn't like on one shoulder. This allows me to adjust the straps, right? Which we'll have to adjust because clearly this is like Dora the Explorer in terms of sizing. Um, but we're gonna adjust these straps. God, this is beautiful leather. Man, that is nice. But we'll adjust these straps and then that way I don't have to put all that stress on one side, right? But everything is in here. Everything is in here. I'm gonna have a great trip. I am loving this. Um, I really, really wanted this in a black black. Can I just say that? Nothing against this tan um, trim, but I really love the black black. 
you can I mean like it's like the snazziest thing it just it just is hopefully they'll do I mean the Alto is there but the Alto has that sort of diamond something shape it's an odd shaped backpack but I believe we are in love all right, so I'm sitting here thinking to myself, would this be my everyday bag? It could be. Um, it's not the way I really vibe because I like to kind of grab my stuff quickly when I'm shopping. So I really am one for the messenger bag or a quick little wristlet. But I'm looking at the inside and if I was, just, say, going out for the day to take care of all the things, grab this real quick, I could because I'm looking at this other side again where they have the two pockets. This this pocket is big enough for my Z Fold 4 with with the pen, right? So it's got the, it's got the phone case, and it's big enough. The older D and B's, those phone cases were literally this wide. We were carrying some small some small tech back in the day, but this is this is a great thing, and it does have that key leash. So if I was thinking every day. So, so be, boop, 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 boop. It'd be quick and easy. So this backpack could become an everyday bag for me versus just when I'm traveling, but I don't carry a lot of stuff. I can definitely see it becoming the everyday bag when I go on my walking tours to take pictures. That is where I can see this coming in as an everyday bag, um, not just for like when I'm traveling, but I am digging it. This is going to be an amazing trip. That is what's in the box.